I lost my father to pancreatic cancer when I was 10. And then I lost my mother to breast cancer when I was 15. I was 14 when I was diagnosed with OCD. I was living in a hell in my own head. I struggled with a lot of anxiety because so many things happened in my life that were outside of my control. But I also had to worry about people treating me differently if they found out and to live with the fear and uncertainty about what this diagnosis meant for the rest of my life. But through my family, through my friends and mentors, I found strength. With the support of my family, friends, a counsellor who accepted me, and a lot of hard work and time, I was able to fully recover. I've witnessed firsthand the powerful effects that stigma can have on discouraging people, especially young people, from getting the help and support that they need. But I've also seen how communities can operate to change that. I have learned that you're never alone in feeling the way that you do, and there is always genuine cause for hope. I'm Brianna, and I'm from the US, and it gets brighter. I'm Emma, I'm from Australia, and it gets brighter. I'm Josh, I'm from Canada, and it gets brighter. We met at the University of Oxford while doing our graduate studies, and we found it, it gets brighter because we want ours to be the generation that cares about mental health. Over 75% of mental health challenges begin before the age of 24. And yet, many young people feel alone in their struggles. We all know someone who's going through a mental illness, but what can we do to support them? It Gets Brighter is a web-based platform that allows people to share their message of hope and support. One in four people will struggle with a mental health issue at some point in their life, yet this does not have to be identity defining. With the right level of care and support, people can go on to live happy and full lives. It Gets Brighter has a library of video messages from celebrities, spokespeople, and young people all over the world sharing their It Gets Brighter mental health stories. Users can search for videos from people like them and can contribute their own messages through the website. In our first year, we've collected nearly a hundred of these video messages of hope and support from people in countries as diverse as Canada, Lebanon, Egypt, China, Australia, the UK, the US, and others. We have growing partnerships with mental health organisations in these countries too, so visitors to our website can access their resources and help seek the support that they need. It Gets Brighter is already making a difference in young people's lives. We've received support from everyone, from Stephen Fry to prominent psychiatrists, and our work has been showcased by the World Health Organisation and World Bank. We've been so happy to be thanked by young people who found empowerment and hope watching our videos, whether they've been in a hospital stay, school, a university or a community. We've recently launched an app that will enable these people to access our resources and watch our videos more easily than ever. I can tell you all that it gets brighter. However, this is all just the beginning for It Gets Brighter and we'd really love to sustain and expand these efforts but need more funding to do so. At the moment we're on entirely by volunteers. We want to continue to expand our community of support and get our message out through even more channels including a YouTube series, workshops in schools, and work with refugee communities. We need your help to do this. Anything you can chip in will help us reach more young people struggling with mental health issues. Help us be part of the generation that cares about mental health. Hi, I'm Kate, and it gets brighter. I'm Tom, and it gets brighter. Hi, I'm Janine, and it gets brighter. Hi, I'm Gerardo, and it gets brighter. Hi, I'm Yoko, and it gets brighter. Hi, I'm Mishan, and it gets brighter. Hi, I'm Satam, and it gets brighter. Hi, I'm Mariangela, and it gets brighter. Hi, I'm Nina, and it gets brighter. <laughs>